cat lover shared her home with rescue cats. Lyniela Tanzi, a woman of good heart and generous soul, started fostering cats all the way back in 1992. Being a vet technician herself, she takes care of her cats and then tries to find new families for them. Lynia founded her Eno Cage, no kill sanctuary for feral and abandoned cats and ran it solo for years without any financial help. Now, the sanctuary has its sponsors, veterinary technicians and cat-loving volunteers to keep the project going. Lynia currently shares her house with more than cats, and each and every one of them is healthy, well-fed and very much loved. A cleaning company offers free cleaning services for women with cancer. Debbie Sardona, the founder of the company, had this idea when one of her clients called to tell her that she had to cancel the cleaning services from that time onwards because she needed to save money for her cancer treatment. That was the very day Debbie made the decision to provide women who fight cancer with free cleaning services. She believes that this way women will be able to focus on their treatment process and not worry about the housekeeping. Starting from 2006 the company cleaned over 19,000 women as homes, which had cost them around znak dollar 5,5 million. A 12-year-old girl fighting a rare aging disease became best friends with a weightlifter. Lindsay suffers from progeria, a rare genetic disorder that ages the body 8-10 times faster than normal. David is an ex-main turned powerlifter nicknamed The Beast. How did these people as pets crossed? Well, they met at Relentless, a sponsored powerlifting event to benefit children with rare diseases and made friends at once. Now they are just inseparable. Lindsay became my little sis since day one, Douglas says. There are no words to describe how I feel about her. She has pulled me out of rough spots just by thinking of her. That is a priceless gift.